is Craig Price from the world famous Priceless Success Coaching. As you can see, we're on Anne Marie's Weight Loss Transformation. Today, what we're going to do is we're going to show Anne Marie a, a bit of a visual so she can see how much weight she's lost. This little boy <laughs> here is my son Toby. Say hello, Toby. Toby. Hi. And Toby is four stone. So, Anne Marie has lost four stones so far on this weight loss transformation. So, what we're going to do is we're going to put Toby on Anne Marie's back so she can see and feel how much weight she's lost. So, this is all the weight that Anne Marie's lost so far on the weight loss transformation. Just have a little bend down, Anne Marie, and just as you're doing it, what does it feel like? Heavy. <laughs> Thinking that this is what you used to walk around with. I know. Can't believe it, can you? You can't believe that every day all that stress was on your joint. Nope. This is a great exercise to do. It's little baby squats with a very, very light weight on your back. You're just moving a very, very small amount each time, only for a minute. Now remember everybody, you can do anything for a minute. Anything for a minute. Going. Remember what the little voices say inside your head? If it's talking to you and talking to you negative, you have the power to change what it says. Because your thoughts, whatever you say to yourself, become your actions. So change those thoughts inside your head and you'll change your life. It's as simple as that. Okay, so in the last video, what we did was we measured Anne Marie, we measured her hips, we measured her waist, and we also measured her bust. So, what we're going to do today is we're going to see how much inches that Anne Marie's lost. So, because until you actually measure yourself, it doesn't, it doesn't it's as if it doesn't recognize, your brain doesn't recognize how many actual inches that you're losing because you can feel the difference in yourself and you can feel the difference in the clothes but until you actually see it then you really start to believe it. So what we're going to do, we're going to start with Anne Marie's bust first so we can see. Now last time we measured Anne Marie her, her bust was 45 inches. So let's have a look what we've got this time. Thumbs up. Do you want to put it around for me? Yeah, going on. Now, last time we measured, if you can just hold it there and reform it, and I'll just zoom in so everybody can see what we're on. So everyone can see that there. We're now 41 inches. So that is a massive four inches lost. Okay. The next thing we're going to measure Anne Marie now is obviously the waist and the waist last time was 41 inches so let's have a little look what we've got this time. As you can see we've got 39 inches. 39 inches. So that is a two inch weight loss. A size loss shall we say, not a weight loss. Obviously, the last thing now to measure is Anne Marie's hips. Anne Marie's hips were 46 inches. Let's have a little look now what, what we're down to. So, if you want to wrap it around your hips for me. As we can see there, we are now. Move your hand that way for me, touch. As we can see now, we're at 44 and a half inches. We've got, which is a. One and a half inch weight loss. So that's a massive, massive weight loss. We've got size loss, inch loss that we've got there. It's huge. You should be really, really proud of yourself. That's awesome. And like we said before, it's actually getting rid of a little monkey off your back. So just jump back on again, Toby, on Anne Marie's back for me. And what I want Anne Marie to do is, I really want Anne Marie just to get a sense of that weight, what it used to feel like, yeah. to carry around that weight with you all that time. I mean, for all those years you carried a little monkey on your back. Yeah. <laughs> for all those years. Yeah. Isn't it unbelievable? It's, uh, I, mean, I mean, do it this way, it just definitely brings it home to you. Right. <laughs> Does it ever? Massively, doesn't it? Can you just explain to everybody, because obviously this is a work in progress, it hasn't happened overnight, it's been a few weeks to, yeah. to get to you lose four stone. Can you say to everybody, you know, because one of the big things that I teach is, is that you've got to have, first of all, you've got to have a goal, mm -hmm. but you've got to have a vision for what you want to look like. Yeah. So, can you tell everybody what, how you've been doing it, how you've been concentrating on that vision for your goal, and, and so you've been moving towards your vision of what you want to look like and feel like and be? Yeah, I've got this vision of, of how I want to be, 
or how I was some years ago before I got married and had children. And that's the vision I've got focused on, and I know I can get back there. But Craig's help, I will get back there. Can you explain to everybody, just this video, just, just to explain to everybody what that vision's like, what, what does it look like? A bit like a sort of glowing light, and I'm in the middle of it with my nice little dress and things. <laughs> <laughs> See, that, that's the thing. You know, you're definitely going to get there. Because it's all about making the smart decisions. This, this is really important as well. Even if you're on the right pathway, if you're standing still, you're never going to get it. No, it's a thing like this thing with inches are brought at home as well. Because, you know, you're wearing clothes and things that you couldn't wear before, and you're going down sizes. And that just proves that, you know, it works. Not only do you think about the weight, because sometimes you think, oh, if you stay the same, it's, it's not happening. Yeah. But it is happening.